Robert H. Smith School of Business students recently had a chance to meet Seth Goldman, founder and TEO of beverage company Honest Tea. He signed copies of his new book, Mission in a Bottle, The Story of Honest Tea, and talked with students about their entrepreneurial aspirations. The event was hosted by the Smith School's Center for Social Value Creation and the Dingman Center for Entrepreneurship, along with the school's student-run Net Impact chapter. It's really important for the Smith School to bring business leaders like Seth Goldman to the Smith School to be able to demonstrate to students what the range of possibilities are in terms of the kind of quality leadership and the role that business can play in society, and to encourage them to think about their contributions both as management professionals but also as members of communities and citizens of the world. Goldman talked candidly about the challenges of growing a company and the satisfaction of creating a successful and socially responsible brand. And so if you had told me that I'd be running an enterprise that's helping to eliminate billions of calories from the American diet and helping to support the growth of organic agriculture and helping to spread fair trade labor standards in the developing world, I would say, that sounds perfect. What's the nonprofit I'm running or, or what's the government entity that I'm involved with? I would never have guessed that it was a beverage company, let alone one that's now part of the Coca-Cola company, or let alone one that delivered a 26-fold return to its original investors. Um, so it's been quite an unusual journey for me, building Honest Tea, and one that I, you know, continues to be full of surprises. And I'm here from Net Impact and also an honors program called Entrepreneurship and Innovation, where we learn about um, starting businesses, but with a social impact in mind and a social impact in our mission. Um, so we want to learn from Seth about how he's done that with his business, and we know that Honesty is really innovative and has done a great job so far. So we want to learn more from a person that's been successful at it and hear, from, uh, hear a couple words from him, hear his ideas. So that's why I came out. It's just really important for students to understand that it's not just the idea you have, but how creatively you can execute on that idea. And I think as the students will hear tonight, Seth was extremely creative in getting honesty to market. They understand the, the, the possibilities. They're idealistic, but they're really gaining the tools to do it. And they're really in a way that the previous generation wasn't serious about pursuing this and making change happen. Um, I have some great ideas that I'm working on and sort of bouncing off um, at the Dingman Center and Center for Social Value Creation. And so what happens, what it takes is entrepreneurs who can come in with a different idea about how to live, how to build a society. And, when the, and it's not just the idea, it has to work. You can't do good for the world if you're not concerned about the bottom line. So I think that um, Honesty has really taken that to heart. And they're successful because they're doing both good and they're doing it profitably. Yeah, I think I certainly want to communicate the possibilities, you know, that um, if you sort of apply what you learned, you can really make things happen.